Hello to everyone, I'm Andrea Damut, in principal of Hyundai Motorsport. Welcome in Germany, in Alzenau. Well, the achievement is huge, because uh, we have to say that in the last uh, three years, Hyundai Motorsport somehow has won uh, six world titles. So for uh, such a com young company, it's uh, the clear, a clear milestone and means that uh, the people working in Hyundai Motorsport uh, it's top people and uh, it's uh, just uh, amazing the job done and uh, to win uh, the World Manufacturer title in WRC that has been amazing and to repeat in such difficult conditions uh, has been uh, even more impressive. I mean, motorsport has every time uh, a lot of good reasons uh, to do so. So one is uh, to build brand, brand awareness, and show the capability of our R&D, of our development. In the second pass, and this is very important for Hyundai as well, is um, to test under the hardest conditions uh, technology. So we are in a very close contact to our R&D in Namyang. And what we do here is directly feedback to, um, to Namyang, to Korea. Uh, and we learn performance at the maximum attack in motorsport. In TCR, the links with the road car are very, very, very close. Suspension, front rear, the engine, as I said before. In our case, we are also using the cooling system, the same as the road car. So for us, it's really nice to see this close link between the i30N road car and the i30N TCR car. because. Uh, it's good to see how the, the, the Hyundai products are matching perfectly in strategies between the high-performance road car and the motorsport activities. Yes, this is the new part of the game and this is where ETCR comes into uh, our portfolio as the manufacturers are all looking into alternative solutions which could be electric, uh, battery electric or uh, hybrids or even fuel cell in the future. There is a chance which opens the door to a new territory which is the first ever electric touring car series, ETCR. So we were in a very early phase and in the beginning of that concept involved. So we had a chance to uh, also shape a bit the future of that series. It's a uh... Let me use to say the word uh, an amazing project because uh, it's really something incredible to see a car that has been uh, transformed in a full uh, uh, e-vehicles with the floor that, has, that now is full of batteries with uh, the motors that are on the rear axles. There are two motors with the huge power we can get uh, 500 kilowatts and uh, to see this car sliding uh, uh, without making noises, by the way, or very few noise. It's amazing. It's a, a very big challenge for my people. We have to learn uh, a new way of doing motorsport. Well, the ETCR is a totally new approach for Hyundai Motorsport. So we change now from combustion engines, from turbo engines to fully electric. And not only racing with electric vehicles, but looking into the whole approach into how to generate the electric which we need, the, the uh, power which we need, um, by generating it with a hydrogen charger, as well as learning the whole package of how to manage electric vehicles under performance and under the circumstances of racing. And this will be feedback back again into our R&D to learn performance cars on electric platforms. The, the, the big challenge is also to uh, work together with our Namyang colleagues, the e-generator, the fuel cell generators. This is something that is amazing because it's really a close link and this is a really, really in the, let me say, zero pollution direction. It is uh, produced with uh, fossil fuels, uh, so emitting a lot of CO2 and other, uh, other emissions. And this electricity is 
either given directly to, uh, to charging stations and then charging the cars or put in a battery and charging the cars. So here with hydrogen, we can produce green hydrogen out of electricity made by wind energy or solar energy or hydraulic energy. So it's green, there is no emission at the production facility of the hydrogen. This hydrogen is transported to the generator. The generator is transforming again this hydrogen to the electricity and thus charging the car. No emissions at all, the only emission we have is water. We are here to win.